Now, are you having the issue where you have turned on cellular image uploads, but then the images aren't uploading? Most of the time, this is an issue with the Android users rather than iPhone users. So sorry, iPhone users, I don't know how to help you, but Android users, what's probably happening is you have no internet on your phone when you connect to the dashcam Wi-Fi. So you connect to the dashcam Wi-Fi, your mobile phone is trying to use the dashcam Wi-Fi as an internet source, but it can't because obviously there's no internet coming from uh, the dashcam Wi-Fi and your phone is not able to tell itself to use your mobile data, it gets confused. So here's what to do in that situation. Go into your phone settings, type mobile data only apps. You might get something here that says mobile data only apps. So if your phone has the mobile data only apps option, sorry, it's horrible that I'm re-recording a different video, but it's the easiest way to do it, then you can click on mobile data only apps. It's under data usage. So you click here, like the man in the video is, and then you can select which apps you want to be mobile data only. So select Hive Mapper, select Phantom, turn on uh, Google Maps, anything that you need to use while you are using the dash cam and connected to the dash cam Wi-Fi. So Chrome, for example, you do the same as he just did, but for Phantom and for Hive Mapper. If you don't have this mobile data only apps, then this is what to do. You do it via intelligent Wi-Fi. If you don't see mobile data only apps here, intelligent, there we go, Wi-Fi, intelligent Wi-Fi. Turn that on, it's already on for me. Let me. And that's it. The internet should now work on your phone because you've told it to use your mobile data for these apps or your mobile data in general instead of trying to use the dash cams Wi-Fi, which has no internet signal.